Começa com o Mats Malheim e Oscar Ota após a conquista do All Eras Open 1. Guys, how are you feeling? What does it mean to you uh, to win this title here in All Eras? Uh, means a lot. It's our first title together. We usually don't play doubles too much, but uh, we thought this week, because we're two weeks here anyway, we would like to play and practice. We've both been injured a long time. And uh, it's been great. The facility is great. The tournament is well organized and uh, we are very happy to win our first team title. Oscar, you, you've won one title in Portugal before, in 2017, I believe, in, in Lisbon. Yeah, yeah. So I imagine you have good mem memories from, from our country. Yeah, exactly. I uh, played three times on Portugal. Yeah. Every time I came back home with a title, no matter if it was single or double. And yeah, I already said to Mats, we played here four years ago, was in, in Lisbon, and it was same hotel, same everything, just different facility. And as Mats already said, it's very important for us that we could win our first title here together and it was a lot of fun, it was a really good week and I think things will help us for next week for singles and we also play doubles. It was pretty much a perfect final, were you, were you expecting it to be done in straight sets? It's always different in doubles because there's a match tiebreak but... Um, well, we are very, we are very confident to, to play doubles because we both have good serves. Normally if we, good, if we serve good it's tough to play against us and uh, we started off pretty well with a break directly mm -hmm. and then we felt comfortable at the end to go a little close again after 5-2 but uh, it was all nerves because when you play for a title it's always, it's always tough to win but um, yeah after the semis yesterday we were in good shape and we were not expecting to win but we, had, we thought we had good chances to win the title here. Yeah. How are you guys seeing the secret nowadays with, with all the restrictions and and all the uncertainties in terms of what you guys can play. You mentioned that you both had injuries. I, I know Oscar, the last time you played, I believe it was in, in Doha during the police, yeah. maybe, yeah. And how are you in terms of physically and, and how are you seeing the, the tour as it is right now? First of all, I think we are both on a good way. I mean, Matt's last match was middle or end of last year. Yeah. And I don't know, he also played Doha, but we were in a good shape both, so. I think it's good for us that we can play quite normal. Of course, it's a little bit different with all the restrictions and paperwork you have to do before, but I think it's obviously better than to stay at home and not make money and just practice. So we are very happy that the ATP and ITF, whatever, is arranging a lot for us, for us players. And yeah, I think we all know when Nobody knows when it's going to be normal, so you have to just focus on yourself and try to play every week, no matter how tough it is with traveling or something else. But yeah, we're very happy to be here. It's much more nicer weather than Germany, obviously. <laughs> and yeah, everything is closed at home. I heard Monday maybe you can eat outside here in the restaurant and we're definitely going to try that. Uh, are you guys planning to play a normal schedule from now on? Yeah, we're going to play as much as we can. Every match, every minute on court is good for us, even if singles or doubles. And uh, we're going to play almost every week, I think, until we get, you know, we need the rhythm, the, the matches and everything. So we play now, I think, for a couple of weeks straight ahead and then see how it goes. If we play better, maybe some weeks off, but for now we're going to play almost every week, see how it goes. Okay. Thank, you. Thank you very much, guys.